guys and today we're going to be doing a tutorial on quick flashbangs and pop flashes whatever and how you can get anybody basically out of nowhere with a flashbang and there's a lot of methods to doing flashbangs I mean you could toss it that way you could toss it this way which is the slowest one or lowest flash and a medium flash and just that long flash I showed first already but there's cer certain ways to use these and I'll be showing you some of them and like the methods I use the first one I'll start with like the the pop flash right there with that well I guess all of them could be cut, like called a pop flash but this one's probably easier to pop flash with without them like looking away but one of the ones I use a lot and you guys will see this in my videos I line myself up with this and so they can't see me through there or up on cat I like to hold it down right here, shift walk, and then just throw it forward. And basically take out anyone mid because if you just go over here and you use the long flash method, I guess, <laughs> and you just hit that wall, what's going to happen is once they hear that click, the guy mid maybe be blind right here, but there's going to be most likely another guy CT or like right here set up. So when they hear that click or their teammate calls it out, Basically what they do is their teammate tries to get out of the way, they pop flash back towards you, and they kill you if you try to even kill them, you know. So this right here is a good way to do it, because they will not see that here, kill them, and then run away. You get the pick, and the guy won't be able to get you. So another one I like using for the long flashes, uh, long range flash things like that. <laughs> is I like to have a teammate sit at the corner right here or you can even do this yourself and the best way I like to do it is set like the car right here and just toss it over the top and anyone that's coming out right here will be blind by it and one of the things they could do too over here is I like to do this personally so I see them shooting alright they're gonna come out flash that now when you do this flash being some people are gonna be already like right here so what I like to do personally and they usually don't run out but sometimes they do but say if you get here really late and you they're already out flash over and uh, that was a fail but I, I'm still trying to get used to that flash but you walk backwards and you know you can do that too either one works but it's really it's really good guys that's how you use that for that flash man. just walk back and toss up in the sky and it basically it goes right behind you so it'll, the flash will follow you and it won't blind you unless you do what I did the first time but um, there's a lot of methods to that like that you could do let's see what the medium flash now this one is kind of hard and I'm still getting used to this guys like honestly I've been playing Counter Strike for like a year and a half now uh, Global Offensive and <laughs> I just found out about this from I was watching one of my friend Doom's video and he's showing like you know one way smokes and he showed, like, showed how to do this basically you hold the left click and the right click at the same time and the guy has like hands turn right in the middle and that's set for medium flash and medium flashes can be used for a lot like pot flashing right there that would have been a perfect pot flash right there say they got their rushing mid boom like you're, you're gonna be able to kill them and basically it's really helpful and I hope you guys think I wanted to, to show before like I end my video here is like I forgot to discuss this right here but like how you use the pop like the small flash or whatever that fucking pop flash is you right click and you just hold right click and basically you're set for that and then you want to use your momentum on here or speed whatever it is and that will determine how like it'll kind of determine and how like where you place your crosshair how far it will go so like if you keep it like a small flick like that and shift forward so anyone that's going to be sitting right there will get flashed, but there's also this method to where you pop flash up, but that one fails a lot, and you got to know what you're kind of doing, I mean, like, you could do it that way, but if you do it that way, like, look, you know, they'll be able to look away from it, because, like, it'll be floating in the sky for a good bit, but my, I like doing this one more, just walking forward and it'll, it'll kind of like matter how hard you flick or how slow so like that or you got this one 
It kind of goes up a little bit longer and it'll land a little shorter, but it'll be like seen less. And same with like running. If you run and just flash like that, it takes a little more time to pop, but it gets that distance in with it. And it'll just take some practice. So like, this is a good practicing spot. Like, if you want to do any of the like pop flashes, practices, medium flash, and basically. It will help a lot. It will help a lot. And it will come in situations like this to where say if like a guy is hiding, I don't know, in that fucking quarter over there and he has a knock and you don't want to get shot. Or he's a really good shot, basically stand right here, flash bang up, and kill him. And it'll work really great and like you guys will actually to be honest guys, using flashbangs can get you a lot of frags into like games and shit. Like it doesn't always have to be just your aim. Like a guy on the other team might have a really good shot, but he can't look away from flashes worth shit. So like every time you can catch him off guard. If you know what he plays, if he's playing mid, use that flash I taught you in mid here and just kill him every time. If he starts hiding and you notice that, what I like to do is I like to set out here I'll look towards the like side if he doesn't come out, you know, after a while, check the corners. Either he's going to be in CT or he's going to be up there. So what I like to do is come around here. I like to check. He won't be able to see you from right here, like if he's hugging this wall. And if you see no one in CT, you can either smoke it or just yellow it. And one of the flashes I like to do is either this, pop it out to the side. I usually like doing a bigger flash like that because the simple fact that it'll pop faster by the time he gets there and if he's not there close most likely either window or or is at the doors right there but you always want to check window first I forgot to say that but uh, after they clear that what I like to do is like if he's in at those boxes and I have CT smoked or I'm just rushing through I like to hit the top come in that guy's gonna be blind he's gonna be blind anyone's in the window is gonna be blind basically will give you the advantage to any of those spots they're playing and you'll be able to kill them all and same with the medium flash it doesn't matter what you use just practice them and you guys will become I guess like you will rank up like honestly flash wings can get you a lot of kills in the game like I'm not saying you can toss them and kill them sometimes but you know what I mean like you'll flash up kill him more. You don't even have to get, have good aim. Like, when someone's flashed, I mean, you can spray at them for, like, a whole good five seconds and before they're able to see you. And by the time they see you, they're going to be dead or, you know, just really lit. And then you'll be able to finish them off. But this has been my tutorial guide on flashbangs. I hope this guy's, like, this helped you a little bit. And, you know, just go on a private server custom one just go to create your own lobby turn it into private and go to casual or custom map and basically you can just do this all day and practice your flashbangs and whatever you need spray pattern and I'll see you guys in the next tutorial just tell me what you guys want to see if you guys want to see spray control I suck at that well I don't really suck at it it's just not the best but I hope you guys enjoyed this video if you do give it a thumbs up I know I already said this earlier but I forgot about this part. So I'll see you guys next time. Peace.